Yo, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Yellow with that Gemi Ginger. My microphone wasn't recording, and I have to start this episode all over again! Yay! At least I'll know what's ahead. And for the third time, I'm going to say this, but to you, it's gonna be the first. Ever since I was little, I thought that guy had a really big afro. Something like Marge Simpson kind of hair. And I only just realized recently that it's a cave. Never gone over there in my entire life. Probably will never go there again. Or ever. I never went there in the first place. But now, I remember that Shady Rain is in front, so I will have to switch him out. So we can fight Toe Jam. And, as I said last time... Alright, you're still struggling along back here? I'm doing great. I got a bunch of strong and smart Pokemon. Here, let me see what you caught, Vans. Last time I remember mentioning... I don't remember what I named my rival when I started this. The, I, I didn't even go back to check the videos. But since I had to restart, I ended up just naming him Toe Jam. I, I don't know if that's what it was before, but that's what it's going to be now. And forever till the end of time. So, I don't, I don't even know what to talk about anymore. I, I talked so much, surprisingly, last time, and I'm just like... Well, what did I even talk about last time? I think last time all I talked about was, well, I keep I kept repeating myself. Ah. Anyway, I remember the last thing I mentioned was that I'm out of shape, terribly out of shape, and that my father is growing some tasty vegetables that are growing quite well in our garden. I live up in the country area, and we got big farmland. Well, not anymore. My father lived on a big farmland, but we don't. We just have a decent size yard for country kind of area and uh da, 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 da. but um though I just have a small garden it's really annoying to take care of though but uh yeah we live in the country area of Pennsylvania in the valley and we uh we get stuff done you, you know what I'm saying and uh I'm gonna stop talking like that I know I do have a valley accent from Pennsylvania. I know there's more than one valley, but the Valley of Pennsylvania. Uh, near the Susquehanna River in the Appalachian Mountains. We have our own accent. I don't know if you're able to tell. But lots of people can. It's really weird. When you leave, if you live in this area and you leave town, people, or not just leave town, if you leave the state, people will, be, will ask you, are you from, uh, from, uh, da, 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 I completely forgot the name of the city. Wilkes Bear. You're like, what, are you from Wilkes Bear in Pennsylvania? And it's like, around that area? How do you know? It's like, oh, your accent, man. I don't know what other people sound like, so. Hey, guess what? I went to Bill's and got him to show me his rare Pokemon. I added a lot of pages to my Pokedex. After all, Bill's the world's famous Pokemaniac. He invented the Pokemon storage system on the PC. Since you're using his system, I am. Go link him. Well, I better get rolling. Smell you later. I mean, I rarely use that system anymore, considering I really pick my team out fairly quickly at the start of the game, and I never catch any more Pokemon unless it's like a shiny or something. Which I only realized at by Pokemon Sapphire, I think it was. And I think even if like, Diamond and Pearl came out, and I was replaying that, um, in Pokemon Sapphire, I found that was the first time I found out um, Pokemon shiny Pokemon exist, and boy, is that a surprise! I found a shiny level five Zigzagoon, and all I had was level forty Pokemon, and I wanted to cry. But anyway, <laughs> I don't even remember other shiny Pokemon in the old games. Probably not, but I don't know. I don't know. Uh, I never actually was able to play the old games a lot. Anyway, but we are continuing on to the Nugget Bridge, and Batman has leveled up. That is amazing. Too bad Gust is not yet a flying move, which I still don't understand. I don't think I understand. Why is it a normal type move? You're using wind. Uh, I, I suppose it's not completely wind-like. No, okay, what am I saying? You're f making wind throw them around. Of course that's wind-like. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. 
I'm second. No, it's serious. Are you serial? Yeah. She's serial, man. This whole thing is serial. It's like, it's a like Cocoa Puffs, but like, serialer. Like a serial killer. <laughs> anyway. Oh my god, this is probably so boring without music, but I keep- I don't- I keep forgetting to figure out how to record the audio from the game, and I don't feel like putting the speakers on, because I don't like how that sounds. Ugh, I'll figure it out next time. Well, probably not next time, considering I'm gonna record a few episodes this session. So, I usually record a few- Oh, what are you doing? <laughs> I hate double I hate moves that hit more than once. I know they can be pretty useful, but I just think they're a pain. Not because they beat my ass by using it. And also because the as everyone who's played Pokemon probably knows, the game just votes against you. What the fuck? The game just votes against you. If it says it hits two to five times, for you, if you use it, it will hit twice. Yes, that was double kick, so it was, it's always hits twice. But for the opponent, it always seems to hit four or five times. It, I, just, I, I don't understand it, but you know... Poke Are you fucking kidding me? Did he use sand attack? I wasn't even paying attention. When I play Pokemon, I just go into game mode, or... Uh, autopilot. So, what? Game mode? What the fuck am I talking about? I go into autopilot, I don't even know what goes on. Okay. I must have used sand attack a lot because I. How can you miss that many times, Batman? Like, seriously. I'm Batman. Shut up, Batman. How can I lose? Because you're a little bitch, that's how. Yay! Oh, look. Alright, I'm just put Sherlock in front. Oh my god, I don't even have that many allergies. Here's number three, it won't be easy. But after going outside for like 10 minutes, my nose is like running like crazy. Ugh, I hate it. Aw, Rattata. I actually, Rattata used to be one of my favorite Pokemon. I don't exactly know why. I don't remember if I mentioned before my favorite Pokemon is Psyduck. Don't know why that is. Oh, fuck. Oh my god. What was that? Hyperfang or Superfang? I, it was, I don't even remember. I, I gotta start paying attention to what I'm actually playing. Uh, yeah, change. But, um... I don't even remember what I was saying now. Yay! Oh yeah. Um, Rattata used to be my favorite Pokemon. Don't remember why. I just remember that. Why are all my Pokemon missing so fucking much? I I remember we used to have this Pokemon game, Pokemon Stadium for the N64, and I realized I probably sound like shit. Let me try that again. N64. I have to realize that I mumble to myself, and I'm just gonna fast forward through this because I fucking hate the move rap. I mumble to myself, and I don't understand how people understand me most of the time. Ah, oh, fuck. Shireen's poison. So I have to remember to try and enunciate my words correctly because otherwise I will sound like a complete git. No, I'm not British, but I like to pretend I am not really. I just watch a lot of British TV, and it just comes out naturally. But, apologies. I don't remember what I was saying again. Oh yeah, Pokemon Stadium. We would go to the, uh... I was terrible at actual Pokemon battles for some reason. Probably because I was never allowed to actually play Pokemon for a few years. But, since I was so terrible at it, I would just go to the, like, the Pokemon Playground or whatever it was called. I'm going to have to go heal. I go to like the Pokemon Playground, oh, that's not its name by the way, I can't remember, and there would be little mini games, like you'd have to make your Magikarp jump and hit a switch and you'd have to see who can hit the switch the fastest, I don't know, it was really silly, but one of them was um, your Rattata racing other Rattatas, and that was the best game ever. I dominated that game, as well as the one where you're Sanch oh my god, I forgot you were there. I'm number four, I'm getting tired. No. Anyway, uh, we'll finish this battle and finish it up. But I was boss at most of those mini games. But the sand trees, you just dug a hole to get to water, which I really didn't understand at the, 
uh, wait, I, I understood it at the time, but now that I'm older and understand Pokemon, like, weaknesses, Sentra's weak against water, isn't it? And, uh, well, he digs for water. He digs for water and gets pushed up by water. I, I don't know. Maybe, I, maybe I'm just not thinking right. But I always thought that was weird. But, well, not since I was a kid. But yeah, I was like boss at those games, except for the drowsy game where it's like hypnosis and something. And the one where you're Ekans and you have to throw yourselves like rings. Which I have to think about it. It was like using Pokemon as objects. That's kind of mean. It's like uh, abusing, pe uh, abusing pets. Pets and Pokemon both start with P. That, that was really confusing for a second. Am I going to lose to a Nidoran female? Fuck it, I'm not losing to that little bitch. Oh, my language. Uh, uh, go Batman! Oh my god. The last time I recorded this, Nidoran gave me a hard time too. What? What is this thing's problem? Anyway. Okay, that thing knows double kick. I'm gonna double kick it in face! Oh! Ah! <laughs> Just quick attack it. Get it over with. I don't have dinner yet. I don't know what to have for dinner. I may just skip dinner. You know, skip breakfast, skip lunch, skip dinner. It's okay. I lost too. Yeah, you little stupid. What do you have to say? I did my best, so I have no regrets. And what's funny is they lose all their Pokemon life, and they're just sitting there. They're gonna go help their Pokemon. Anyway, see you next time.